Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to show you how to make custom hooks using WordPress Astra's Site Builder. Alright, so we'll have a very simple example for today. So right now we're on our shop page, our shop catalog, and in a previous video we've made a custom header here. And it's distinct from our homepage header, as you can see here. And you can see that on the shop, that if you scroll down, yes, sticky, we have a discount code here for orders over $500. But what if we, as you, as you can notice, there's some example items here that are organic or grocery items, but we have smartphones and tablets here. And what if we wanted to have a special type of uh, banner here on the top that says discounts up to 5% off on all electronics, right? And we didn't want to mess with our header over here. So that's where we can use hooks. So hooks basically are areas, predefined locations where we can execute code within our WordPress website. So for today, we want to execute a code which shows or displays a discount banner. So let's head over to Astra and let's use the site builder and create a custom hook. So we're here in the site builder, click on hooks and click on create new. Okay, and then we'll call this, we don't really have to name it, but it's easier to give it a proper name so you can navigate through it on your personal, uh, your specific site layout catalog. So we'll call this uh, just to keep things in order. And we don't really need to add any blocks here, maybe an image or two. So let's go ahead and insert, uh, let's see. We insert a column or like a couple of them, 50 50, right? And we'll put an icon here and let's call it, let's choose something else, right? Or, okay, insert this icon here and let's a paragraph and let's say. Okay, and we can probably align it on the center and give some options on it here. And if adding in margins, we can probably put it down a bit here. And we can probably adjust the layout too. Two columns. Mm, yeah, that, that that that's probably fine. How about we put some? Mm -hmm. We can make it bigger. And how about this whole thing over here? This whole block. We can put a background color of yellow. Okay. And. Right, we can also adjust the mar margins of everything inside. And we can also add a border if we wanted to. Oh, not too much, probably like one pixel, I guess, should be enough. And we have our, our typography over here. And... We can add letter decorations like underlines and stuff. Okay, and there's our simple hook. Okay, and let's get let's head over here on the upper right side. We have Astra, right, and we also have Spectra page settings, but don't worry about that. 
Astra and make sure it's a hook and we can choose where to put it in um, like where in our page in particular and let's go ahead and choose to add this to before a single product summary and where do we display it on products and then we type here us uh, all singulars for smartphones right singular singulars means single pages or posts that have the tag smartphones on them okay and then you can display it for all users for the moment so once we uh, once we have everything in order here and here as well and you can also choose to enable or disable it on um, certain devices as well as uh, make it a time event so we can choose a certain time if it was a limited time offer but once we're happy with all of that you can hit on public uh, click publish and wait for it to publish and let's head back to our product catalog over here and once it loads it shouldn't appear we should only have the um, discount on every order over five hundred dollars and once we click on a smartphone we should see our custom banner over here our little hook that goes before the product before the product summary and again if we wanted to put it elsewhere on the page you can see that we can put it before HTML on the head on the body top and right now since we only have it on our products over here we make sure that it's it's over here but let's say you wanted it to appear up here for whatever reason or or much lower then we can put it up here oops after header hit update and once we refresh this you can see that our new our banner our hook over here ends up up top here under uh, after the three rows of our header instead of uh, on top of our product and its image so there's a simple hook for you if you found this video helpful please leave a like comment and subscribe to our channel as it really helps us out with the youtube algorithm show this kind of video to other nerds like us thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one